Hey everyone, it's Francis Xavier, logging on to make awesome videos one at a time. And here with me today is a special co-host, my good buddy Aaron. It's been a long time, guys. So I decided I wasn't feeling good. I was staying home from work today. Uh, and I decided I'd watch... I'd actually never watched any of his Nuzlocke because I've been really busy with my own stuff. But I figured, why not start? And, uh, well, I haven't caught up, but... Uh, I guess I'm going to figure out the spoilers because I'm still planning on watching the other episodes. I'm mainly here just to heckle them and be along for the ride and be comic relief. So, alright. You're already in Fuchsia? Yeah. Okay, so, are you going to be able to trade over to Leaf Green while you're recording? Yes, because um, Aaron here was so kind enough to uh, grant me with a second wireless adapter. Yeah, I found it in storage. Which I have with my other Game Boy that I've got with me in my hand right now. I didn't actually realize that would be useful to you. I just said, hey, you're playing Game Boy. You're doing an actual hard copy Nuzlocke. Maybe this will help you somehow. And I guess it did. I can't trade with Emerald because, you know, that's post trading with Emerald is post-game thing. However, you can trade with another copy of Fire Red or, with what I have, Leaf Green. Which I gotta find my other oh. copies somewhere because I do have these games. I, play them I guess this must be my first time up here. Well, I mean, to be fair, you've been nuzlocking. There's been no reason for you to come up here. Yeah. Yeah, I know how the union room works. I may have never used it before, but that's just because, you know, basic never concept, had anybody. The basic to, concept. The basic concept. Never had anybody to. Tr also, never had anybody to trade with. I think right over to your right is where the two wireless go. No, this is where the wireless goes. The one on the right is where you go. If you just have a game link cable, oh, that's why it's called the direct corner because mm. you need a game link cable. Yeah, I find it weird that the adapters didn't just—they were like marketed to completely release to completely replace the link cables, and then they didn't <laughs> for quite a few games. Well, they did for. They did for, like, the Game Boy Advance games, but then when it came with the Nintendo DS, everything was already wireless, so... Yeah, it was, like, it was attempting to give a function that became baseline to the next console anyway. It was... Only in a far more limited fashion. So, if that, if... So, you went to the area that's for the wireless adapters, right? Yeah. So, where's the other you? There. Oh. There we go. Oh, sorry, my leg just popped. So, uh, you're just doing this. How many trades are you doing? Are you getting your Haunter? Do you have a Haunter as well? Um. Huh? Last USSR? What? I actually haven't looked you at this. You haven't reset their file, have I you? I haven't even looked at this file yet. Do you even know if they're far along enough to trade yet? They have a Pidgey in their party. Sounds like they've already traded before. So yeah, this like completely gets around the nuzlocke. Cause like even nuzlocks admit it's kind of BS to not be able to get. Oh, crazy. you got to go up to this board. I've never actually done this before. Board. Here, let me go. Let me show you. And that's what you got to do to trade. Welcome to the trading board. You may register your Pokemon and offer it up for a trade. Oh, so you don't talk directly to people like you do in Gen Four. Correct. Yeah, I never connected with anyone in Gen 3, really. And when I did, it was for... Be Emerald literally... St actually, no, sorry. That started with Emerald, because I remember my buddy I hung out with in middle school. We actually had to... Uh, we did it for Emerald, and we were able to talk to each other, Trey. We didn't have to do the board at all. Let's see. Leave Prim, you gotta hope they give you the right water type. This is a 
big skip ahead for me because uh, I was watching back when Slash was a Squirtle. It's good to see he uh, he lasted this long. Yes, the train will be started. Unfortunately, you will be missing Merlin evolving. Because that's going to happen on the small screen. Yep. But he's going to come back, and then you're going to see him now. Not to mention... Oh, yes, See if I can get my phone to work. So why did you name your Alexander Merlin like after the wizard? And doy. It was like psychic powers as close as we have magic Pokemon in this series. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, they have a squirrel. And... Boo. Oh. Oh, you're gonna splice that in later? Just did. Wait, wait, so your phone recording's hooked up to this already? I don't know how oh, some well. of this technology works. No, dude, I'm editing this in post as we speak. Oh. I mean, All right. Does that mean you're technically editing it in the now? Because yes. it's not in the post yet? Because we're in the middle of it? To us, yes, but to them, no. Ah. Uh, you're it, not it, thinking... F you're not thinking fourth dimensionally here, kiddo. Look, man, you're the YouTuber, not me. Oh, no. I did that. Trying to do two things at once. Man, that looks like a pain to register that. Try to do it both at the same time. Not exactly a smart thing to do. Yes, please. It's already been almost ten minutes. Really? Feels like five. Nice. Ah, and now, now we get to see Alex's hand, and that stat boost is there. Really he is. Hell. It's definitely going to help in the battle against Koga. Oh, oh yeah, yeah. Definitely. And maybe even against Sabrina, because, you know, he does no, now Shadow know Ball. Shadow Ball. One of my favorite things of playing Fire and Leaf Green when I was a kid was seeing all the sprite updates. <laughs> This is our uh, this is our first remake of Gen One. Bye bye. There was still between Emerald and and this game. There were uh, quite a few unfinished features, like the weird shifting cave on the Sevi Isles that didn't do anything. I forget the name of the cave. It was like Union Cave. Not Union Cave, like Connection Cave or something. Altering Cave. Thank you, that. Yeah, I remember we talked about this before. Also, like it never really did anything because the feature was never fully implemented. And the cave underneath uh, the Battle Frontier in Emerald was kind of lackluster. It's like, yeah, you can get Smeargle here, but that's about it. A whole cave system dedicated to that was kind of off. <sighs> Unfortunately, she's... That like, can't be traded yet. She's eight level. She's eight levels too weak. They evolve into Haunter at level twenty-five. It's not too weak. It's too young. It's just you haven't leveled it. So these are all Pokemon you've like actually gotten. Where's your dead box? Do I even want to know? Ah. Oh. 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 Yikes. Not 
monkey so piss maybe too. She, so maybe you should think twice before before you go so easily in the heckling. You know what? Never mind. Heckle away. No, I'm, I'm still gonna heckle you. Sometimes, First I mean, it's, it's a Nuzlocke. It is unavoidable in the end. Oh, that beautiful special attack and speed. Oh. What's the nation? It's Modest? the perfect one. Oh, well. Just like this is the perfect one. Well, uh, I'm trying to remember the nature that lowers attack up speed. Uh, that Modest does lower attack but up special attack. I'm talking about the one that lowers attack up speed. That's timid. Timid, thank you. It's a Which better nature. Great for, for this one. Yes, it's bestest for Jolteon. Keep him at top speed shape for yeah. an already speed boat. Yeah. All right. So what are we? Have you gone to the sports yet? Poor man's Raikou, I call it. Oh, most people call it. I mean, it technically has a slightly better move pool selection. Oh, Let's walk fine. around it. I can't. Cause you see. Be. Okay, go, go back. No. No, what I'm telling you is I can't walk around it. I swear there was a way without cut. Go up there, back or right. Oh, look. Go up the other way. Or around. Yeah, like, again, those are just shortcuts, but there is a, absolutely a way up without using cut. Look at the zoo. Yeah, that joke is funnier in the first game where the sprite for Voltorb is the exact same as the Pokeball, as the item Pokeball. Yeah. Nowadays, it's just kind of... It's a bit of a dated reference because it displays... Yeah, okay, so before we go in here, remind me of our Nuzlocke rules here. It's, are we doing... Okay, we are doing more than one run. However, I think, okay, okay, so make this fair, because most people sh count each area as an encounter, but they're only allowed one Safari Zone run. I think that can completely break your game if you don't happen to get Surf and the Gold Teeth and the same run. That being said, there are three, to get the, to get the Gold Teeth and Surf in the fewest number of steps, you will still have to run through a significant portion of Tall Grass. And the best part is, just doing this counts. As steps, or? As as trying to encounter Pokemon, but it doesn't decrease your step count. Oh, that's beautiful. So, are we going to tally down which areas we've gotten our encounters for? Cause I've already done, I already have a file for that on my computer. Good, good. So, I'm here to help with that, I suppose. So, are we doing a one a, a one run? Are we doing that then? If you don't get it this run, you're bricked? It's up to you. That would make it harder. Correct. So, do you have any plans to do any other Nuzlocks? Not in the near future, because right now I'm going to worry about... Uh, right now I have more pressing matters to deal with, like school. Ah, uh, that's right. Are you sure you should be getting on your bike? Didn't that double your steps? Nope. No. No, it doesn't. It just makes it go by faster. Oh! Oh, first, first encounter area three. two? A do duo. Well, let's see if we get it. Dodrio is a good is a good flying type, especially That's in this right. gen. Oh. It was so close, it wasn't was indeed. I forgot what Safari Zone encounters look like in this game. Yeah, it's been a minute. <laughs> it might just run. Well, let's just hope I catch something before I run out of Safari Balls. Honestly, if you bring go. Oh, cool. Area 2? You still have an encounter for Area 1. Yes. So go ahead and write down to do it as your Area 2 encounter and that it's caught. First off, nickname. Yeah, all they get is with Dodrio, Ichi, Ni, and Kevin.
Uh, a little, uh, an inkling of one. Kiwi. I mean, it is technically based on a kiwi. It's like a long-legged kiwi. So that's the encounter for area two. Well, I'll be perfectly honest. I think I should stay off my mic in order so I don't overshoot myself. Yeah, there's an item. Are we not getting all the items? No, can't get the item. Can't get. I'll get that's that true. item, but not. I think a second run specifically for item gathering should be fine. But uh, oh man, because Nido King is really good, man. Yeah, even in this gen. Oh, dude. I, I've been doing a yellow playthrough of Nito. I got a Nidoran early on, and I... Please, let this, this not be... Okay, it's just a Nidoran. If you see a Chansey, I'm gonna... In Area 2, I'm gonna cry. But if you also see a Kangaskhan, I'm also gonna cry, so... I love... I, I can make a... T I can happily have a team for the Safari Zone. Actually, this is giving me ideas for our story. You, you, told, you mentioned our story to the viewers, right? This is Area 3. Once or twice. Area 3? Yes. Our area 3 encounter is... Neater and Bale! Neater and... You'll have to level it a bit and then use a moonstone, but... But still, it's something. That is, if it doesn't run... I like the ne I like the Neater and line a lot. I like Nido King. I actually like Rhyhorn aesthetically a little more than Rhydon. But I like Rhydon. I love Kangaskhan. Honestly... I know it's like half of it is like a Giovanni team, but it looks cool. I could happily make a team aesthetically that I like out of Safari Zone Pokemon. Because you can catch Dragonair, you can get a Nita King, you can get a Kangaskhan, you can get a Scyther. Like, come on. Ah, that's right, we gotta name him. I. I. <laughs> no, no, sh no. Do you know no, what I you're would name joking. him? joking. Nidoran male is a male. I would name him Varen after the kaiju, because he, because Nido King kind of looks like Varen. I've already decided. I just need to remember what his name was. Altair, like after a Alt Altair, like the star, as in Altair and Vega, the stars of the Weaver Girl and the Cowherd, you know. Ah! Tanabata. The, I think the so. Tanabata so that, Festival. Hey, write down your encounter. That's a good catch. We need to put some love into this one, because Nia can, can carry you. Is there a move relearner in, in Gen 3? In uh, Far not Green? until a little later. But there is one. I can get that item. Steel Wing! Oh, please. Please be something common. Okay, it's just another meter in. Same level, too. Protein. Protein! Dang it. Wait. Okay. Man, you're just tempting fate to make just break your heart. And look at that. Look at that. That hurt to do. Not really. It did for me. It hurt, may have hurt you, but it didn't hurt me. Right. So we're in the right area... Here, right there. Gold Teeth. And then... So we have an encounter we got here. Do you have a Super Rock? Or better yet, do you have someone with Surf right now? Wait. Damn, you're about to get Surf. Booyah! So we still have an area one and area. There are a couple areas, side areas we didn't go to. We are at two sixty eight out of six hundred steps, dude. We got plenty of time. 
First off, I want to see if there's anyone I can teach Surf to that isn't Slash, because I just used up my Water Pulse TN. Even though Surf is a more powerful move, I still want to have more than Water Pulse. Uh, okay. Te technically can't... Hey! Snorlax! I don't think it's good on Snorlax, but it can happen. But wait, hold on. No, no, what you saying? better on Slash. I know you wanted to have Water Pulse, but Surf is just better. <laughs> I know you just got Water Pulse, but Surf is better. And it hits the whole board at double battles, if that's relevant. Surf, Ice Beam, Rain Dance, and Protect is really nice. Yeah, the Confusion's okay, but if you want to start spamming status, slam with Ice Beam. Don't get over Ice Beam. Come on. I wasn't going to get rid of Ice Beam. I'll just... It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. I guess I was just a little bit overzealous to have a Water-type move that wasn't freaking Bubble. Yeah, I mean, I mean, it, it's, it did it serve you until you got to Surf? That's the purpose. I suppose. Alright, so you can, now what you can do is you can either... You can't surf yet, I don't think, because you got No, it. I gotta get Koga's badge. But, if you go south into the right... Nope. I gotta go back up. Yeah, but there's another air. So this is... We already have this air's encounter. So we're missing an area one encounter, and I think an area five encounter? 207 left. Oh, shoot. We may not make it. You saw that, right? Yeah, I was wondering if you knew what that was. Need a Reno. It's okay. Okay, so this is area what? This is area four. So we haven't had an area four encounter yet. Grab the item over here. Ooh, not bad. Not like You're on revive pulse, right? right? So we need an area one. That's all of the items in this area. Sweet. Now we just grab the Pokemon. It's a good thing you don't need a fish. Watch. See? Ah. And that'll still trigger Pokemon. Oops. Well, you still want stuff. Who cares? Okay. And execute. Pretty common. Nothing fancy like Scyther, Chansey, or Kangaskhan, but... Counter if we can get back there in time. And yeah. So area one. Yes. Are we in area one? Yes. Oh, sweet. And you're in fire red, so Cypher could pop up. That's one thing. I like fire red a bit better, is because you can get Ekans and I think Scyther in fire red. Because I love Cypher. Damn it. No, I've already got a Venonat. Oh, Dupes Claws. That's one of the few clauses I will do is a Dupes Claws. Because Dupes just kind of is boring. So, Area 2 was Doduo. Area 3 was... Nidoran. Was Nidoran. Area 4 was a bust, and we... Are dupes again. We're duping and duping until we get our... Until we get something we haven't well, seen. Well, if we get a Kangaskhan, I'm like, ooh. Hey, what's your current make? Oh, well. That'll have to wait. Dupes again? Yep. The benefit of catching one of the most common Pokemon, huh? Is when you get yes. your Dupes Claws. Hey, whoa, whoa, wait, 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 wait. Check the team real quick. Fifteen steps left. Oh, Jesus. Uh, we're cutting this close. Uh, so, what would we even cut out from here? I mean... Technically, Snorlax is a better normal type than Kangaskhan. Rhydon is still really good. Tauros, used, Tauros isn't as good as it used to be in Gen 1. Whoa! Oh! Whoa! Oh! One of my favorites.
favorite rock types? Do I throw bait or rock? Rock will... Tauros or, or... Sorry. Rhyhorn are very skittish. Bait will make it harder to catch, but they will stay around longer. That's up to you. I'm just going with the balls. Oh, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Use the old trick. One. You hold the B button. You were holding the B. And pulling down. Okay, okay. It's okay. I love me Rhyhorn, man. Didn't they even put Rhyhorn in the uh, in the gym, in the uh, other Safari Zone in Owen? No, 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 no. Okay, okay. You can do this. This is our last encounter for Safari Zone, and it's a good one. No, 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 please. Oh. Oh, so much for that. Now they're now half the half the Safari Zone is catch locked. I, what all is left? Uh, there are only four areas, aren't there? Yes. You, your entire safari zone is catch locked now. Execute fled, Rhyhorn fled. Yep, yeah, that's what I said. The entire zone is catch locked. The entire safari zone is now catch locked. You said half. I'm like, there's some way up though. I mean, technically, yeah, out of your encounters. Yeah. Well, I mean, at least you got a Nidoran out of it, I guess. And a Doduo. Yeah. Is very close to evolving into a Dodrio. So, uh, what do you think we should do? Okay, so, um... I say I'm so... I say I, I want to see if, if he can do... If Harry... If Merlin... Merlin sorry, I keep confusing him with my normal Alakazam. Can do at least one gym trainer. Okay, so... He is. There he is. Yeah, if we can get Altair in. I'm surprised you're not raising that Dratini right now. <laughs> I, I left something in the daycare center. And I'm not, and I can't remember who it was. Oh, did you get Fly yet? Yes. Do you have a Pokemon who can fly? It's been in my party since I began. Oh, Homer. So you have another Dratini? Dang Oh, that's right. You have to go through the house. But we don't want a shortcut with cut. Well, my Pokemon that I had been used for shortcutting with cut is gone. dead. That would, be, that would be Mr. No. Who? My shiny Ekans. Oh. Again, I'm just saying, power level wise, if you can get that Dratini to 55, it's a powerhouse. It is the game pseudo. It is. But I'd rather. Like, I'm gonna tell you, once I got a Dragonair with agility and rap, I kind of had no more problems in, in red version. Like, at all. Because the Jill rap was disgusting in Gen 4. And just in Gen 3, Dragonite's so powerful on its own. Especially since Hyper Beam still keys off physical in this generation. So, a thing you could do... Unfortunately, you don't get the Earthquake TM until you beat Giovanni. Because that would have that would made that would have made Nido King really good against Koga, at least some of the gym trainers anyway. But they also randomly throw in psychic Pokemon in that gym, so keep that in mind. Where's the Shadow Ball? Yeah, that's what I was asking myself. Where is it? Yeah, don't go into combat without that. There it is, Primo. Please tell me Merlin also has psychic. Okay, good. Give her a side beam and we're good. Machine set <laughs> Alright. 
So let's look at the team again. Oh, you should, uh, oh! Go turn in the teeth to, uh, the Warden. Right, and then he'll and give And there's a free rare candy in it for you. You can put that on your Snorlax. And the best part is, she can learn strength now. Headbutt's really good. However, you're not going super competitive, so I'd go over Headbutt. I was saying getting rid of Yawn because... Yawn's a really good move on a Snorlax. Because Yawn, then they hit you, then you rest, then they fall asleep, then you snore till you wake up. Get rid of Headbuck, because Snore also can flinch. True. Alright. Fine. Strength hits a little bit harder. Headbutt is generally used mainly for the flinch of competitive, but... Here, that's not so much. You need strength to get around, especially once you get to the sea foam islands. Which reminds me, are you doing the legendary the legendary bird encounters, or are you skipping? Because they, I mean, you get a really strong Pokemon that can still faint, and you have to basically put some of your Pokemon on the line to get it. So, are you going to use that rare candy on your Nidor and Mail? I'm gonna train it naturally. I'm not. I don't even think I have. I think that's my only rare candy. Probably. Yep. Because yep. I used I used up all my other rare candies. But you do have a boost. Uh, what is your Dieter and Nails move set right now? I don't know. I'll check. Also, the other reason I kept the, um, I'm keeping the wireless adapter attached to the Game Boy player because, fun fact, if you don't have it attached to your Game Boy and you go into the Pokemon Center, there's a full second of delay before it lets you in. If you well, don't well, have it attached? No, no, it's like, you go inside and then there's a full scene of delay, a full second of delay before the scene changes to inside the Pokemon Center. Like, you can see the vague outlines in the darkness of it and then it shifts into it. Weird. Has to do with some kind of wireless shenanigans. Ah. Wasp. Ah, Miss Frisbee. Echidna. Yeah, you can get Growl from this game, which I love. Where'd you encounter a Growlithe? Out seven, huh? Failure. <laughs> Not horrible, except for helping hand. Uh, let me see that build again. Go back to the to, to the moves. You said, well, you said Lawrence. ability, so I went to ability. Sorry, I meant I meant. Moves. Uh, fury attack is bad. Helping hand is bad. Horn attack's alright, poison sink's alright, but it's pretty weak. I huh. wonder what moves you've got we can put on that to make a Nido King really shine. Again, you're wanting Earthquake, you just don't have Earthquake yet. Also, it's even better back in the day in Gen 1 when there are no EVs and it's just a strong Pokemon on its own. On the one hand, if he has, if he, if I keep him a Nidoran and level him up to level forty-seven, he'll learn Horn Drill. Nido King doesn't learn Horn Drill. Okay, all right. No. Here's the thing. That's no. an Oko move. That's trap. But at level forty-three, Nido King learns Mega Horn. That's a bug move on a good physical beater. That's worth. It. 
Mm. I've always loved the eater of male line, aesthetically. If I had to make a pure Canto tea. Mm. Let's see. I feel like ev almost everyone wants to include a Dragonite. So, mm -hmm. alright. I know... Even Ash I... got his chance eventually. Yeah. Alright, so you know the trick for this one, right? First shot. It's about to get hella levels. Yeah, you can see the invisible wall outline just barely. See where the squares have bigger white uh, corners. Juggler. Shadow all time. Hello there, beautiful. <laughs> Always love that animation. Oh! Didn't do that much. Oh, gas! More like, oh, gas. Not now, not now. Oh, you can fix it. Just good thing there's a Pokemon Center directly next door, huh? Yes, but please, I'm trying to, f I'm trying to concentrate. Is there a concentrate on? Just pick your moves. I've okay. had way too much heartache in this nuzzle. This is a sh this is a surefire trade-off. And all you gotta do now is give him a bit of a potion and get him to the Pokemon Center. You don't even need to give him the potion, really. Dang. Congrats. 38, just like where that Hypno was. Yeah, Caden, get punked. Hit. No. Oh, the the superior psychic type. 150, 49, 48. You'll make it. 46, 45. But what were you saying before, just like Cadence something? I said get punked, Caden. That was the name oh. of the juggler you just beat. Let's see. The next one up has three drowsy, both at level 31. And a level 31 Kadabra. Sounds like Shadow Ball fodder to me. What do we feel like? I guess, I guess using the guide isn't cheating. Besides, I had the guide laying around from when I was a kid. Why not use it? It was collecting dust otherwise. <laughs> Seven levels of difference should make that smack a lot harder. Yup. Bye-bye. Drowsy one, gone. Drowsy may have higher special defense, but he is of a lower level. And your special attack is pretty dang high. Correct a move. Oh, goodness. I wonder if Merlin's speed has broke 100 yet. It did. Yeah! It did in the last level. Oh, he's almost at 100 HP, which for a frail psychic type ain't bad. On you, but better. Though, aesthetically, I like Cadaver better. Like, honestly, if their defenses weren't so bad anyway, I'd love to do, like, in the modern days, an EVO like Cadaver, but that's just kind of a waste of time. <laughs> EVO, I remember my EVO like Scyther, though. Oh, I remember. Oh. I remember. I remember. I, I actually don't know which one I like better, Scyther or Scizor. I ran Scizor for a long Oh, he's barely hung on. Bonk. On. You can end up with a psychic. Of course you Shadow Ball has more power points. But I still feel the need to recharge them. I mean, might as well. I mean, again, you're leading with a physically frail Pokemon. Not to mention, the Pokemon Center is literally a stone's throw away. Yeah. A Geodude throw away. It's... No, no, sorry. It's a rock throw away. 
better, but still a lame pun. You've made worse. Alrighty. And next up is... Oh, that's interesting. Level 33 Arbok. Two level 33 Arbok. And a level 33 Sand Slash. The Sand Slash, you might want to let Slash do that. Oh, I have no problem with playing like, slash surf all over that This is two psychics and a wind condition right here, man. God. Joke's on you, I don't got no attack stat. Yeah. I would have been marginally impressed if it actually lived through that. 39. Broke 100 HP. At low speed. Oh, I love it. You'll love, love to see it. it. Gangs. It's, oh, no. Uh, oh, no. Two I'm intimidates. How, what am I going to do, Psychic? Two intimidates on a special sweeper. Oh, no. Oh, no. What will I ever, Psychic? Boom. Honestly, you can pick your poison. You can surf or ice beam on this, but I'd probably surf with the stab. Oh man, ice beam on slash is going to be really important for the league. Oh yes. Mmm, <sighs> that juicy same type attack bonus. Level up, level up, level up all around. You don't even need to heal. You didn't get hit. That I surprisingly do oh. hold it. Yeah. That I, I got really good at seeing these walls. Go to your right. Down. Left. Or right there. Not really. <laughs> oh, I'm going straight in the sand slash. Ah, just swap out. It's fine. I stung a little bit, but not too horrifically much. Ah, uh, you're fine. So what do you want to do next? Arbok back, swap it out, shuffle it. That being said, I am still four levels under <coughs> Koga's wheezing. Uh, don't mind me, I'm also going to be cooking a burger. Still recording in the living room. But it's still. right next to the living room, so I'm right here. Ooh, before that, it's over there. Alright. And I really and hope something tragic doesn't happen while I'm not looking. Anyways, let's see. This guy is. Drowsy and him now. Easy. Shadow Ball. Yep. Yep. Shadow Ball's carrying you. For a poison gem, it's a lot of psychic types you gotta beat. But I still haven't gotten the first trainer in the gym who's like on the bottom left side. I mean, he's after beat, you can still. F you don't get to fight him after beating the gym leader, do you? No. Yeah, no. that's right. You get locked out of trainers after you beat the gym oh, leader. Oh no! It wasn't enough to knock out Drowsy, and now he's poison gassed me. That's okay. You've got a potion, and you can get to the entrance. Besides, I'll let you get to that other dude. Weirdly, poison gas has hit you more than I've seen it hit anything else, because it's got pretty wonky accuracy. It's legitimately a worse toxic. A more flavorful toxic, but a worse toxic. I almost wish I didn't replace Bite. Nah! Well, again, it's a weak bite's a weaker attack than Shadow Ball and has the same it has the same bonus. <coughs> You're not gonna get stabbed when either Shadow Ball hits harder and can lower their You need to swap out now. No, I 
need. I. Okay. It's your decision. A meditate's only gonna make it harder. So faster. Right, but you gotta hit hard. That's the thing, and meditate's making it hard to hit. Meditate only raises attack. It oh. Reduce oh yeah, that's right. Meditate's weirdly an attack raiser. There. Forty. Is that your first forty? Fitting. Yeah. Fitting. It's your favorite psychic type. And one of my, and one of, if not me, of my favorite Pokemon. Hey, out of the original one, well, I won't say 150. Uh, out of the original 146, not counting legendaries, you know. Uh, what would your dream Kanto team be if you could? Um, Alakazam's definitely Alakazam and Blastoise are definitely on there. Alakazam, Blastoise, and Dragonite easily make top three. And Jolteon. Good point. So that's four right there. But I want... But you know what? I want, I want a good... Of, of course, of course, of course. Nine Tails. Yeah. And Weezer. I just feel like I... One of them should know a good grass type. Hmm. Oh. Then you have to I mean, Ninetales can learn Energy Ball later on. That's true. In fact, your Ninetales did have Energy Ball. Smoke any cocky water type that thought I can get through. Or ground type. Mm-hmm. A lot of my favorites just happen to be from Gen 1. Yeah, it's not Gen 1 bias, it's just... They're I grew up with it and I find a lot of designs as a kid I really liked. Like my bed. Sorry guys, I'm eating cheese dip while I'm waiting on the burger to cook. Yeah, but don't eat it all and leave some for me. Got plenty in there. Alright, I'm gonna eat one more heal up. Mmm. Was that the dude in the bottom left corner? Yes. Sorry, I took away. Hmm. I wonder. First off, I'm going to store some items because my bag is getting rather full. I do still have bag space. Wait, no. Oh, I forgot the days of bag space. Sheesh. Let's see. Mr. Nose Death hurts me especially, not just because he used he had cut and flash, but also because he was my item gatherer. Yeah. Pickup ability. Almost indispensable. Oh dude. I used to get a team of pickup builders and just run around. 
The amount of rare candies you can get that way naturally. Unfortunately not possible in no salon. Yeah, because you, it's rare to get multiple pickups that don't die. Alright. Nope, one more. Nope, yep. Oh, I thought it was one more trainer. A little bit over. No, uh -uh. it says it says it's supposed to go. There you go. Oh. All right. First off, just because it's been a minute. Oh, that's right. I was going to. to use items during battle. Oh, dude, are there some Nuzlocks that don't let you? Oh, yeah. I guess that makes sense. That's rough, buddy. What's the insurance? I can't forget. It's weird that Saffron City is the biggest city in the region, but it, but it's Celadon City. It's a next-door neighbor that has the mall. Mm-hmm. Or the, de the department store. It's not a mall. It's a ball. It's a damn near the same thing. It's just a giant, tall store. Malls are the closest thing we got, but Japan has... Japan in the time at the time had malls and department stores. <coughs> really, the department store is basically like a big, like, three, four-story Macy's. Slash Dillard slash... Yeah, Macy's and Dillard's. And J.C. Penney. Biggest heartbreak of Gen 2 is coming to Celadon and figuring out that's not where you can get stones anymore. No, 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 no. Easily biggest heartbreak of me for Gen 2. Though, still my favorite Gen. Four special attacks should give you some good. Back then, these would be just four special, X special. Well, the special slit had already happened. Yes. Or it just buffs both stats. No, no, it only buffs special attack, but there was no X special defense yet, which is weird. Man, I really never used the X items, like, at all. Yeah, they can give me an advantage in this battle and not let me just... Oh, no, absolutely. Like... I can see using them when your Pokemon's lives are on the line. I get that, but I just never use them because I always felt they were kind of a crutch. Like, if, if I raise my Pokemon right, they should be hitting just fine, you know? Yeah. That's the way I saw it. And then you learn that it's basically like using the item version of, like, Howl, or... Well, no. Because it brings them to their absolute max for that battle. So, an next special on Alakazam is going to make him hit like a freight train. More like he'll zap like a lightning bolt. Sting like a beedro? <laughs> a mere child like you dares to challenge me. The very idea makes me shiver with mirth. Creepy. Very well. I shall show you true terror as a ninja master. Ah. Poison brings steady doom. Sleep renders foes helpless. Despair to the creeping horror of poison-type Pokemon! Man, confirm Koga gets his jollies from scaring children. I mean, he's not a member of the... He didn't later become a member of the Elite Four for nothing. First off... Ooh. 
hope you're on an antidote. I brought plenty. Your first few turns are just gonna be set up, right? Yup. No need to waste time on X accuracy, though. I might now. Okay, maybe now. But that poison's gonna start racking up fast. But first, X special. Let him let him waste some smoke screen first. And by plenty, I mean one. Yeah, that didn't sound like plenty. Shush. <gasps> My heart froze. All right, setup is done. It's time to go in swinging. <clears throat> You're gonna have to swap him out, man. Not this fight is going south. Fuck. Get him out of there. I'm trying! Turn-based combat! So, do you, didn't you pick up a full restore somewhere? Yes, I did. I only have one, though. Would you rather use it to keep Merlin around? Please, I'm trying to think! I'm trying to think! This is not going how I thought it was gonna go. Slam him hard. Woo! Right. That's for scaring the crap out of us. Minimize. I miss I miss Brad and I hate myself. I hate myself. I do, I do, I do. Acid armor two? Well it doesn't matter that much because Acid armor just up defense, right? Sharply ups defense. You're not hitting it with physical right now, just slam mm -hmm. it with surf. Woo, look at that! But still, double minimize. The minima- ooh, man. Not now, not now. And the rain stopped. It's up to you if you want and to missed. Shh. Oh, thank goodness, toxic mist. <sighs> mm. Shush, shush. Damn it! Oh, no, 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 no! This is wrong! This is wrong! Okay. Think about this. Dude, wait, 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 wait. Before I you can't, I can't, I have nothing else! Listen to me. Stop freaking out. Swap into another Pokemon. Swap into your Vile Plume. Hear me out. Then use that, because right now, every turn you spend is a time he's getting hit and taking poison damage. Swap into Joni. Shush! I'm trying to think. Please, just. Okay, I'm cool. Try I'm trying, I'm trying. I'm literally telling you how to do it. Of course. Wait a minute. Just remembered something. Come on, please. You're not listening to me. I'm panicking. I can't listen. You, that's your problem. I literally am telling you how to beat this. He's literally making it impossible for me to hit him. Well, what I'm saying is. The reason I was having you swap into Joni is so you didn't take any more damage from the Toxic or his hits. So you can you can use this time to heal your Pokemon. With what? With the potions you have, smartass. I'm gonna die. This Nuzlocke is over. I mean, if you want to be pessimistic, sure. Why don't you stun for him? Okay. 
Think about your moves. You could, but you're gonna have to be really on top of it with that with that potioning on that on that poison because it's toxic. Toxic gets worse every turn. You could try and get Joni out of harm's way. Mm. If the toxic poke is switched out of battle or if the battle ends once the line R is reset to one it becomes non-cumulative. Oh, so if it swapped out the toxic doesn't ramp? So it goes from badly poisoned to just poisoned? It's, it would seem so, but I'm checking to be absolutely certain. <laughs> Generation 3 fixed it. Fixed what? The non-cumulative thing? A Pokemon that becomes badly poisoned in Generation 3 and Generation 4 with Toxic will no longer have its status changed to regular poison if it switches out or the battle ends. So it's still badly poisoned. I want to kill myself. You didn't prepare with the antidote. You knew you were going against a poison leader. I thought I had it! I had it! This is where you need to think. But I thought I did! I thought I did think! The only thing I can think of now is this. The only other thing I can think of... That's not going to go very well with acid armor. Or that'll do a lot because of a crit. Honestly, if we can get past this muck, it's going to be a little bit easier. Problem. First How many match. can they do in a, in a match? Don't know. Probably forever. But the point is... Here uh, is the good thing. If you get poison, you can just rest it with Jenny. Problem is... Ref. Weezing is 13 levels over her. And when Weezing comes out, that's... And look, watch! <laughs> oh. All right, you're going to have to come with terms with the fact that you're probably going to lose somebody. Do you want to do it on Slash? Or do you want to do it on Merlin? Merlin won't get much gain. Here's my, here's my thinking. You swap back into Merlin when he goes into Weezing. And then Psychic's going to hit it really hard even without the X-Special. But, but Slash can't do much right now. It's going to be a tough one. But if you take it easy... Good timing. Good timing. It's only two turns. Sorry, I used to play a Rest Talk Suicune build. It was one of the most fun things I've ever played. Just two, it's two to three. No! Rest in peace, Jenny. I want to blame someone. I want to blame someone other than me because I don't want to. Just... No! No, this is wrong! This is wrong! You've got no one but yourself to blame. He went in half cocked. Please do not fucking remind me. That was my only Snorlax that was going to carry me through the league. But guess what? Mikey just came in and took care of it. All right, you have a choice here, or that.
That wheezing, though, you need to swap back. Okay, good. Damn, that Thunderbolt hit hard. Swap back into Merlin and just ace it. The poison, if you hit hard enough, the poison should not be able to catch up with it. Mm. Alright, psychic the crap out of it. Boom! You win, and you only lost Jenny. Pokemon Company really did just, like, make Toxic even worse, then wonder why people were spamming Toxic. Get to that Pokemon Center and... That's what I'm going to do next. And I'll come in the next part, I suppose. So I guess that's an until next time then, huh? Well, first things first. That's my only strength user. There are plenty of others who can use strength. But she was damn one of the best. I know your new strength user, Altair. Can Nidoran use strength? Once it gets to Nidorino onward, yes. Last time I checked, anyway, you can double check me in the decks. Oh, go on now. Over Fury attack, easy. No, 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 no! Can nothing go right for me today? I mean, in the end, it was better than Horn Attack anyway. Oh, in the end, it was worthless! <laughs> Let's see what other TMs you have real quick, man. Come on. Don't you need another cutter anyway? Look at that. That as a move is worthless outside of the main world, but I can go over helping hand. And then later you just go to the move deleter. So you can get rid of cut. And then later you'll put earthquake on it. The Horn move. attack was gonna go anyway. did move relearning back in this deck. And rock smash is worthless. He can learn sludge bomb, but that'll count as a special attack next generation. But, but for the purposes of this Nuzlocke, it's fine. In fact, he probably should learn sludge bomb, actually. Because it's a physical move this generation. What's even his nature? Mm -hmm. Doesn't really matter. <laughs> Quiet. Quiet. But, you got a lot of quiet ones. Which means this thing will load. <sighs> Plus special attack minus speed. 
It's a really bad nature for him, but you got what you got. The good news is it's uh, not much of a speedy mon anyway, so. At least I got my fifth badge. That brings the level cap up to, let me see here. Uh, That's level cap is still at level forty-eight. Huh? Because Sabrina's Alakazam is the same is the same level as Koga's Weezing. <laughs> okay, so your cap is five levels above their their strongest. Correct. Okay. Okay. Um. Well, thanks for joining me. Sorry it didn't turn out so well. I mean, you got through. Just you lost no, Jenny. No. I'll see y'all again next time. Thanks for tuning in. Francis Xavier logging off.